I'm Desmond Marino. And I'm Jack Carey. And we're here at the first annual Burlington Public Library Comics Con. Today, fans of movies, video games, TV shows, and comic books have come together to make fantasy reality. So grab your power-ups, use the force, and have your superpowers handy. Let's go! We're here with library director Michael Wick. How you doing? I'm good, thanks. Yourself, Desi? Pretty good. Right. So, um, what's going on today at, at the uh, Comics Con? Well, today we're having a library-wide event. It's going to be all day long from 10 o'clock in the morning until 4 o'clock in the afternoon. Uh, we've got programs happening all throughout the day. Uh, we've got exhibitors who are showing up, uh, comic creators, comic retailers, virtual reality setups, uh, trivia, crafts all throughout the day, and events just going on all throughout the library. How was the event put together? Well, I wish I could say I did it all, uh, but I didn't. And this is all the uh, work of our staff. Uh, there's a couple of staff in particular who've been wanting to do this for some time, and uh, so we got the funding uh, and were able to run with it. And luckily, most of the exhibitors and uh, retailers that we have here uh, have just offered their services uh, free of charge, and so it's been excellent. So we've been able to put this together for, uh, for everyone. It's all thanks to the staff. Yeah, staff is everything. Yeah, absolutely. I'm Jack Carey, and I'm here with Nathan Porter of um, Rising Storm Karate. So, how has the con been treating you, and how was your panel? Uh, you know, this event has been great. Uh, all the kids are all, all smiles, you know, very happy to be here, very excited, very energized. Um, but we really focused it in, and uh, they're doing really well. This, this place is great. How was the Jedi Training Academy put together? One of my buddies started a, uh, a Comic Con in Vermont. And, uh, you know, I'm a big comic fan, so they invited me to come in, and sure enough, I, I showed up, still getting a little used to the Jedi event, and uh, it just really took off. And with that said, uh, I've been invited to a whole bunch of other Comic Cons, and I'm happy to be a part of it, and, uh, and really kind of grow the good, and that's what it's about. So do you think any of the kids have potential in bringing balance to the Force? I do indeed. I think our future's in good hands, they're all building strong, keeping their safety, and uh, really showing their self-control, which is very cool to see, especially using lightsabers. Ha! You are going to take your lightsaber, you're going to bring it up, and you're going to strike! And let's see if we need a noise. Let's yell, yeah. Are you ready? Yeah! That is one! Yeah! Please! Ready, get set, two! Yeah! Ready, get set, three! Yeah! Ready, get set, four! Yeah! Run back to that start line, run! Very nice, okay. Do you know where we can find any more information about Rising Storm Karate? Sure. Well, I so I have a martial arts school, and you can find more information at risingstormkarate.com. And uh, thank you very much. Thank you for your time. There are a lot of people here, and I'm sure that there's going to be a lot that are going to come. Yeah. Uh, can we expect the same thing in uh, with Comic Con, Comics Con to? for years to come? Oh, absolutely. We're already are, uh, starting to look at what we've been doing this year. Uh, even before it started, uh, we were looking at what we've been doing and kind of the response we've been getting. And so we're already starting to formulate our plans for next year to make it even bigger than this and better. I'm here with the Dark Knight himself, Batman. So how's the con been treating you? It's been great. I've loved it. This is great. So many fans, so many Bat fans, Little Robins, Spider-Man, Superman. It's been awesome. It's always good meeting my fans. So how was your commute here from Gotham? Commute was easy, very quick. The Batmobile, it's uh, pretty fast. So how long did it take to design your costume? Well, about six to eight months total. Uh, various parts, some were purchased and some were made, but uh, about six to eight months, I would say. Very cool. So have you seen any of, of your foes like Joker or Harley Quinn here? Not yet, but I did hear that Joker has escaped yet again from Arkham Asylum. Now, any of you out here, if you see Joker, come. 
come and tell me. I need to take him back. I'm here with Dan Clary from Castle Thunder Gla Graphics. How are you? Not too bad, how are you? Good. So, uh, could you tell us a little bit of info about your vendor here? Uh, sure, yeah. I, I have birthday, Christmas, and greeting cards, um, and some prints of uh, my art and, and some pins. How are you liking Comics Con so far? It's been fun so far. Yeah, it has been very, very fun. What would you say is your favorite postcard that's on here? I would say my favorite is probably the Mr. Horse. So where can we find more info about Castle Thunder Graphics? You should look up Castle Thunder Graphics on Google, and I'll be on there. I'm also on uh, Facebook. I'm here with Amy Carter of Counterplay Comics. Now, how are you liking Comic-Con? Comics Con? It's, it's been interesting. A lot of great people. The community's awesome here. We love it. Tell us about your store. I know you were based in the Woburn Mall a little bit ago. Um, yeah, we were at the Woburn Mall, um, but we had to move because by Woburn Mall. Um, and we found this really great place here in Burlington, right down by um, Burlington Jade and Jimmy's Family Restaurant. And uh, we've been there since November. We sell comics, we sell vintage toys, gaming product, records, and we sell Warbler, which is a, a material that cosplayers use to make costumes with. Um, just a little bit of everything. Who's your favorite superhero? Oh, that's so tough. <laughs> Oh, I like all of them, but I like villains. So, who's your favorite villain then? Oh, hmm. My favorite. I like Loki. That's very cool. We are on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. I mean, you just Google Counterplay Comics, you can find us. Um, we have gaming events, we have sales on certain days. We, uh, it's just crazy over there. <laughs> We're here with Queen Elsa of Arendelle. How are you? I'm great. How are you? Good, thank you. So, could you tell us a little bit of uh, how you assembled your costume? Um, yes, well, of course, it's not a costume, and I work very hard with my icy magic powers to make every dress beautiful. Um, and they're all very similar, but you'll notice different icy designs on each one. <laughs> okay. We're here with Lena of Avalor. How are you doing? Hola, I'm doing great. <laughs> okay. So. Uh, could you tell us uh, how long did it take to design your costume? This costume is actually a gift from mi abuela. Ah. <laughs> and um, could you tell us a little bit about uh, the universe that your character comes from? Sure. So my character is actually part of a kingdom called Avalor, and it is a uh, Disney show. And I have a younger sister named Isabel, and I actually came out of an amulet from a different princess. I was trapped in Sophia the First amulet for 41 years, and she freed me, and now I had to take back my kingdom once I got out of the amulet, which was very difficult. For 41, you look very young. <laughs> well, I stayed 16 the entire time. <laughs> ah, I see. Can you tell us about the universe you come from? Um, yes, I come from the kingdom of Arendelle, my sister Anna, and of course everybody knows Olaf. You know Olaf, don't you? And um, it's it's a beautiful. We we have seasons there, just like you. So it's it's very nice. Right now it's you know still winter, my favorite season, of course. And we'll be heading into summer, you know, in July, just like you, in June and July. And that's Olaf's favorite season. <laughs> uh, could you tell us a little bit about the company Ice Queen? Sure, we are a child's entertainment company and we mainly work on the North Shore, but we can be anywhere in Massachusetts, New Hampshire, we travel a lot. Um, and you can find us on Facebook or Instagram at Ice Queen Cosplay Princess Parties. And we have a website called IceQueenCosplayPrincessParties.com. And we do guest appearances, we do different events, we go to conventions. So you can find us by looking on the page and seeing where we're at. Well, thank you for speaking with no me. No problem. <laughs> so, how has Comic Con been to you today? Oh, I love it. It's so we, it's very magical. We met lots of little princes, princesses, superheroes, a mini Spider-Man. It's very exciting. <laughs> the best part for us is seeing all the kids light up, and it's very magical and rewarding. Well, that's all the time we have for today. I'm Desmond Marino. And I'm Jack Carey. Thank you for watching. <laughs>